Hello and welcome back, everybody. My name is Phoenix here, and wait, Pikachu, back, back! Don't you dare use thunder! Pikachu, we got somehow they escaped in here. I don't know how they did it, but. That's actually what we're opening today. We are opening the Shining Fates Pikachu V-Box. So, I believe it comes with four packs in it. I think we're gonna open two. I'm not entirely sure yet what we're gonna do. Um, let's go ahead and see what we get on the first one and we might just go ahead and open the second one because I love you guys. I love having fun with you. Let's go ahead and see if we can get some fantastic pulls out of the Pikachu V-Box. All right, guys, let's go ahead and jump into this Pikachu V collection box. So, I know we opened up a couple in the last video, but this one is actually just dedicated to opening up this guy right here. Um, so it looks like, get charged up with Pikachu V. It's easy to get excited about the Pikachu V, and this collection features Pikachu Shining Fates booster packs, along with two versions of Pikachu. The famous little Pokemon that always does its best, it's time to spin, charge, and electrify your collection with a super-powered Pikachu V. Bam! Here is the code card for the Pikachu box. And then we have our giant Pikachu card here, which is very beautiful. I love the Volt Taco he is doing. Um, here it looks like it might be called Charger Thunderbolt, but very beautiful. And then we have the tiny one right here. Then inside the Pikachu box comes four packs. So we're gonna start with Corviknight. Can we replicate like the one time that I pulled the Charizard V out of a single double box? Okay, here we go. And let's pull from the back. There we go. That one was on correct. These ones have been very weird. Um, but yes, there was that time that I pulled the... What was it? It was the Pikachu V out of... Um, I'm sorry. It was the Charizard Shining version out of Champion's Path on a single box of a double. It was insane because we'd opened up so many packs before just looking for... Um, looking for for, uh, I guess the VMAX Charizard and the shiny one. So it's insane that this has came through, but wow. Okay, starting off with our shiny Thievul. Very, very nice. Um, man, this set does not disappoint so far, guys. I really hope you have the chance to get your hands on these. Uh, this is not disappointing at all. So we have Thievul followed by a hey, Celebi again. So this box, I think this was one of the ones I paid for at the other store. They charged me $45 for this box. That is so disgusting. I can't believe that's how it worked out like that. So it better be, I better get some pulls in here that equal um, <laughs> $45 or so because that was an overcharge. Guys, do not pay that. Just wait around. There's going to be more Shining Fates coming out. Um, we're going to be able to get our hands on more soon enough. So there's a float so followed by A. Uh, indeedy. And... Two packs left. Uh, so very small little product box. Not a whole lot to talk about um, with the Pikachu V box. I would say I think the tins might be better. Uh, the tins always seem to have pretty good pull rates. These boxes aren't bad too, but I've yet to... Um, I haven't seen anything for a while since I got that V, the shiny Charizard. Uh, Shinx, Horsey, Yanma, uh, Morpeko. Ooh, a, glare, a shiny Mr. Rhyme again. So we pulled him in the last video, but I will take it. Actually... We just had the shiny, the other one actually. I don't know if it was Mr. Ryan, maybe it was, I'm not entirely sure. And our last card, we have a Professor's Research again. Not bad, I'd say. Uh, two shinies of the box. Well, last pack, fair better. All right, boys, this is gonna be the one. I can feel it. Let's go ahead and do this right here. Code card, go to the front. And let us finish this off strong. Energy, Rusted Sword, Elder Gloss, Star Tricks, Trap Rich, Yanma. We got a coughing. Followed by another more Peko, a horsey onto a Ooh, a shiny Dartrix. Very nice. The shiny ones are coming in hard, but it seems to be kind of hard to get a full art shiny. Uh, let's see if we can follow this any better with a Manfi non-holographic. Okay, so I was wrong. This is the box I paid 45 for. Look at this. I don't know if you can see it there. Look at that price point, $44.99. What a ripoff. We're just gonna go ahead and open this one as well, um, just to get some more packs in. One Pikachu box is not enough for us. Code card, big Pikachu, tiny Pikachu. For me being a small Poketuber, I sure, spo I sure spoil you guys. I hope you, everyone can appreciate how much I throw down, <laughs> how much I spend for you guys to have good content and to have fun. I do my best to set myself apart from everyone else and to try and give you guys the best experience that I possibly can. Um, so I hope you guys are really enjoying this. And if you are, um, you know, drop a like, subscribe if you guys really enjoy the content and like hearing me talk. 
uh, about my Pokemon adventures. I love being here with you guys. The responses we've had so far from everything has been absolutely amazing, and I, I just appreciate the support from you guys so much. And it, this is just a ton of fun, and I can't wait to see how the channel continues to grow. Horsey, Shinx, uh, Spinnerack, coughing, reverse foil, can't almost tell, onto a professor's research. God, those are the absolute worst. I can't believe that that is <laughs> what they do. Okay, I think there just must have been some weird boxing error in- Wait, I almost did it wrong. Yeah, for some reason, I don't know why some are on backwards and some are on forwards. Kind of a weird packaging area. error. My guess is that they can't print out enough product and they're really rushing assembly because of the absolute lack of Pokemon cards right now. Uh, Trapnik, uh, Floatso followed by A, Zarud. Yeah, the lack of Pokemon right now is really bad, and getting your hands on some is very, very hard. And now, I can't believe that people are charging almost triple MSRP for this product. It is just absolutely horrendous what they're doing right now, so... Uh, I, I don't know how much I'll be able to get of this product based off of that, but hopefully a couple target runs, I'll get a little more lucky, and we can come across a couple different things. Snom, Trapnik, we got Rowlet, uh, Weasel. Wacky followed by A. <gasps> oh, there we go, guys. We got a Cinderace VMAX, my favorite starter, and we got him. That is awesome. My very first VMAX of this set. I am super stoked about that. And he has Max Powerball as his big attack. Uh, I am super glad to pull this bad boy. Cinderace is my favorite starter, and I, I love using him every single time. So he looks a little heavy to the left. I can't really tell, maybe on further inspection, but wow, very, very cool. Uh, we're seeing some nice products so far. But, is that the only thing I'm gonna get from this $44 box? This ain't gonna cover it. <laughs> Unless there's a Charizard in here. There better be something super ultra mega cool in here to cover this. Otherwise, I think we are gonna take a massive hit. Dartrix, we got Luxio. Gym Trainer, we got Cacnea. More Peko, we got Isnam. Horsey, Nicket, coming up on the last couple ones, guys. We got an Eevee followed by A. <gasps> what is it? It's shiny. It's rainbow. Guys, is this it? Let's see it. Oh! It's not it, but it's the Al Creamy VMAX. Oh! Well, I don't know about this, guys, but this is the rainbow rare of the box. It's not the, um, it's not the Charizard we were looking for, but... I love Al Creamy V. This cake is beautiful. We got the one out of Champion's Path, and now we have the rainbow version of this bad boy. So, I don't know how that fares in the really expensive box, but we got two V Maxes, which is actually very nice. So, I'm very appreciative of that, those pulls. Um, yeah, very cool pulls so far from the set, guys. I am very stoked, but man, look at that happy cake god. Absolutely gorgeous, everyone. Oh, God, just taking that in. He's just like a rainbow, rainbow delishy cake. All right, everyone. So let's go ahead and flip on over for the wrap up and talk about everything we got here. <laughs> so not bad, everyone. We pulled the one secret rare in the set. I think that's the only one rainbow rare. Obviously, I think there's a lot of secret rares. However you count it, still. We got the giant cake, which was absolutely gorgeous. Uh, very, very fun. And did you guys really think I would not wear two shirts? The same shirt in another episode? <laughs> I didn't mention it, and we didn't talk about it. But it doesn't matter. We had some a lot of fun today opening the Pikachu V boxes. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please make sure to subscribe and ring that bell for more Shining Face we have coming up very soon. I believe we're gonna hop into a tin next is our next video. Um, if I can get my hands on any more that's not overpriced, like uh, some of the product I had in today's video, uh, we'll continue to keep opening as much as I can, but there might be a wee break and we'll probably go back to a Vivid Voltage Booster, hunting for Pikachu. Uh, we have Hidden Fates coming up soon. We, we got a whole ton of, ton of fun for you guys, so. Again, my fellow trainers, thank you so much for watching. And as always, you guys are the true heroes, and I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good night, everybody.